Howdy there folks, how are y'all doing? My name is Reese, and welcome to another YouTube video. Now, in the last episode of this series, uh, this series had a different name. It was called A Series of Videos Disguised as... Mi no, a Minecraft... Dis what was it? A, a discussion disguised as a Minecraft video. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, the fact that I can't even really remember what the series name was is pretty indicative of how terrible a name it was. Uh, and it wasn't intentional. It genuinely started as just an update video with a Minecraft sort of background, which is why I called the first episode uh, discussion or an update video disguised as a Minecraft video. It was supposed to be very clever. What I didn't expect was that I would just keep playing the pack and keep making videos. And uh, considering how terrible the name is, I have made the decision to go back and rename every episode of the series to just Minecraft. It is a modded Minecraft, it's FTB Endeavor, but let's be honest, I'm not really taking advantage of the modded aspect of the series all that much. I'm kind of just playing Minecraft, and there's some fun modded stuff in there, just kind of in the mix. So, we're just calling it Minecraft, and uh, we're charging forward to episode 25, where inevitably someone will blow up the mountain and uh, murder me dead. That's just how we assume it's going to happen. Well, no, I'll get away! I'll do a Protocol Epsilon, or Ralphius Aerith will show up, or Mufasa. I'm not planning any of this. I just know I've done enough Minecraft series to have a general idea of what's going to happen at this point. But I just wanted to start this video by announcing that, yeah, the name has changed. It's just Minecraft now. Uh, I think there's a lot of videos that have been recorded uh, already where it still refers to it as discussion series or whatever. That's because I have this terrible habit of just recording and recording and recording and never actually getting around to editing the videos until week later. And I'm trying to get on top of that. So I've actually put a stay on recording on everything until I catch up. So we'll see how that goes, you know? We'll, we'll see because there, there's some things that I recorded in early November that are still not out yet. We're gonna get around to it. No, you mark my words. We're gonna get around to it. I promise you. Uh, but, yep, last time in this series, we set out on an adventure to explore the ocean next to our base. Oce ocean? Oce ocean? Ocean? The ocean next to our base and got distracted with some pillagers and now, I believe at the end of that episode, we decided we were gonna go back to base and drop off some supplies and that is where we resume. So let's resume. Let's get right to it. Hmm. Here we go. Hemp. What do I do? Do I just break it? That's... Okay, yeah. Cool. And then we can replant with the industrial hemp. My gosh. We, just, we shouldn't have done this just yet because we've got just so much other crap in our inventory. I also need to collect these potatoes and get them baking, but I don't have, again, any way to store them. So let me empty out my inventory. Let me stop being silly here. You know what, folks? I think things are getting a little out of hand up here with all of these chests. I think that it might be time to do one of these. Big old iron chest. Plop that down over here by the food, uh, more or less. And that'll be the sort of like nature chest. Just to kind of help us out a little bit better when it comes to sorting all of this stuff. Okay. I am now ready to go on a real adventure. I'm bringing a proper shovel this time. Got my sleeping bag. I'm bringing everything we need to build the monster ball, considering that's the thing that we are trying to actually build. Uh, and we're looking for coral blocks, wherever we can find those. Apparently, in a botany pot. What? A water bucket and a bubble coral block will produce more bubble coral blocks? Am I... <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let's just cycle through all the different types of coral we've got. I see that we've got a lot. Uh, does that apply to, like... Yeah, so that's weird. Have to figure that out when we get home, maybe. So even though these are a terrible, terrible food source, um, I'm going to just... I'm, I'm going to bring some more with me anyway. And then the sun is setting, so I think we'll head back down to the beach. And I think we might just start... Well, no, I don't really want monsters to get an opportunity to spawn, because then even if, you know, even even if we sleep or we wait till sunrise, they're still alive uh, and, and possibly hiding out in the shadows in the wet places of the world. Oh, we've entered the wilderness now. That's right, because we've left my claim chunks area. Maybe it's because I had to reinstall the mod pack and then I copied the world over. Perhaps... The data for claimed chunks is not stored in the actual world file? 
Maybe? Interesting. Maybe I should go ahead and just, you know, even though there's there's no one else running around out here, maybe I should just go ahead and uh, increase my claimed chunk area and just really, like, boldly declare that actually all of this is mine. Don't mess with me. Yeah, good. Hmm? Dolphin friend! I want to swim with you, dolphin friend. Let's let's be best friends. So now I'm just waiting for the sun to sink low enough that we can go ahead and sleep the afternoon away down here. Um and then first thing first light, we're gonna set off on a grand adventure. Oh yeah It's adventure time. Not the not not the show. Just what I'm doing right now is in fact an adventure time. Whoa, what is that thing? What what is that? That looks like an alligator gar, but those aren't in Minecraft. Actually, it looks like an Hi. Oh, you're just a regular old alligator, aren't you? Oh, you're a crocodile. Well, I'm about to die. That's unfortunate. I cannot believe this. I I I saw at first I thought it was a snake. And then I, it looked too thick to be a snake, so I thought, oh yeah, alligator gar. Definitely alligator gar. See an alligator gar. Swim in rivers with alligator gars. It's just a southeast Texas thing, you know? That's life. You get used to it. And then I got closer, and I was like, alligator. And then it got me. I was like, oh no, it's a crocodile. And then it ate me. And now I gotta go back and get my stuff back. And I don't know... I don't know... <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna do. Mo small consolation is that maybe he... No, he didn't despawn. He's still over there. He's still over there, but he's not, like, close to my corpse. Oh, but he's swimming back. He's patrolling the area. Well, I don't want to die again. That's the problem, right? Like, I need to get to my body and get my stuff back. How many corpses can I have simultaneously? I don't know. Also, I don't like the fact that... Yeah, there he is. I see him now. Okay, hold on. Um, Can we lure him to land where it'll at least be a fair fight? Also, that's not my boat. That's my body. I don't even see my boat anymore. All right. We may have to build another one. Can we build an ebony log boat? There's a, It looks like there's dolphins over there by my corpse. Do you think they'd protect me from an alligator? I mean, they didn't the last time. Um, there we go. Uh, that's actually pretty sick looking. I like ebony log. We might need to build some stuff out of it. I mean, it's got a slight, like, evil vibe to it, but honestly, I love it. So, um, we'll plop that sucker down there, and we will build ourselves a boat. Whoa! Were these on the regular crafting table? Interesting. Maybe. Maybe I just haven't been paying attention. I don't think I've used a crafting table in a while. Okay. So, we're going to, like, um... <laughs> turn it. We're going to sail a bit of a ways around this fella. Kind of keep him in the corner of our eyesight. And uh, there's our old boat. Just going to swim up to this uh, floating corpse here. Transfer items. And be on our merry way. We're not even going to look back. We're just going to start sailing. Okay. Sick. I think we're safe. He doesn't look like he's following us. It does look like there's... Oh, there's some sort of a drowned man in the water over here. I see it on the map. That thing, those things terrified me the first time I came across one. I didn't know they were, they were a thing in the game, and, and people were laughing at me in, in the in the comments section. Lol, Reese, you idiot! You've never seen that before. Welcome to Minecraft, lol. And yeah, look, I I haven't. Oh, good, it transferred everything exactly where it was to. Good. So I guess we can just continue our adventure. Um, should we go ahead and get rid of our death point though, uh, wherever that was? So we're traveling south. Remember last time we went up north and we saw where that got us. Should we have marked that place? Y yes. Add waypoint. Pillage. Get it? Like village. But <laughs> it's pillagers, you know? And it's red. It's dangerous. It's like a, a village of pillagers. It's a it's a pillet. Anyway. Whoa. Whoa. What is this? It's like a crater. Why aren't we going down to check that out? That's a point of interest. I mean, that's way far away from where we're at right now. We just did a loop around this island here. Kind of out of curiosity. That feels like something we should be exploring at some point, though. Just got to remember that it's down there. 
I don't really know what to look for out of a coral reef. Is it going to be obvious when I'm at one? How is it different than the floor of any other like, part of the ocean? I mean, I know in real life. I'm asking in Minecraft. Don't get snippy. <laughs> now, wait a minute. <laughs> wait just a second. What am I looking at here? This looks like ice. Um, Are those coral blocks down there? Wait a minute. Hold on. I've got I've got so many questions about what's happening here. Because this is ice. But then these look like some kind of jungle trees. Oh, and then we're back. Okay, yeah. So this is coral. I, I We found what we were looking for. But I have more questions than answers at the moment. Um, eucalyptus log. Rainbow eucalyptus as well. That's fun. Is there an axe that will fell the entire tree in one go? Dude, I didn't realize pack saws were in this. Why didn't we build, like, an iron pack saw? That's great. I love those. If there is an axe that cuts down an entire tree in one fell swoop, it's not being obviously, like, named. I don't know. A mystical agriculture axe might. I'm sure if I just looked some of these up, they would tell me. I don't really want any eucalyptus log. What does it look like, though? Oh, actually, I do kind of like that. Um... We'll hold on to it for right now. But we did we did actually find what we came here for, which was this stuff. Uh, real question is, remember earlier it said something about putting it in a botany pot to summon. And we're still not entirely sure what that was all about. Should we collect extra for that, though? I mean, I'm going to. But still. Drain coral. I hate the name. Um, there it is. Dead brain coral. Oh, something tells me it can't be dead. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not seeing that as a build option. I guess we'll try real fast. Yeah, okay. Also, did I not bring the... Oh, we don't need light blue dye. What we need is um is cayenne dye or cyan dye, if you're so inclined. So we actually need to combine that with green dye, which we can get from cactus paste uh, or from a, a number of green plants, that none of which I'm seeing right now. Also, though, I don't... I mean, clearly that didn't work, so how do we harvest this stuff? You can't use a pickaxe. In fact, there's very little... I mean, if basic chemical tank. I can reinfuse it. I can I can combine it with a good one inside of whatever that is. The dead stuff doesn't really have much use to me. Uh, we're going to have to figure out how to collect this stuff. Do we need silk touch? What do I need to do here? There's probably There's got to be a secret. Yeah, so according to... The internet, uh, I did a duck duck go search and I will need silk touch. And I don't know how to get silk touch without just building an enchanter and enchanting it. I mean, there's a silk touch unit. There's a silk touch upgrade from mining gadgets. Applies the silk touch enchantment to the mining gadget. It's <laughs> a lot of slime. It's <laughs> a lot of slime. Uh, an item that we know that um, we, we can't just get. Wait, wait, what is happening? Oh my good gosh! Whoa! That's just a whale. That's just a whale there. Well, I'll be. <laughs> I'm just sitting here, I'm trying to, trying to respond to, to messages, I'm trying to, to Google things. Just a whale, a full stinking whale. At least they're, I think they're friendly. Um, slime. It's ironic because we need this to get the slime. I really, I really just don't know how to collect coral otherwise without silk touch. And the internet is telling me I have to have silk touch. So maybe we just have to build an enchanting table, which isn't that big of an ask, really. So we don't really have that many diamonds. All right. Well, we know that we can come over here. What the heck is that? Just, just a random sea pickle. Okay. Sure. Uh, <laughs> we know that there's coral here, so we'll throw that down on the map. Coral! And we will not let it be red, because that isn't reasonable. It needs to be, like, sea coral colored. This stuff's kind of pink. We'll go with that. Well, now that we know we can't just collect this stuff, it does kind of call the purpose of the rest of this entire, like, operation into question. Why even bother, you know what I mean? Get in, get in there. What are you doing? What? Am I hitting the wrong button? Yes, I am. You... I've been playing Borderlands 2. 
<laughs> you press F to get into vehicles. Um, at least the way I have it configured, I don't know. I don't know what I was doing. I, I was I was trying to hit F to get in a boat. I know you right click it. I've been playing Minecraft for over ten years now. Trust me, I know that. Twelve years? Have I been playing Minecraft? Uh, yeah, probably. If not, right at twelve years and close to. Uh, whoa, what what have we here? Is this bamboo? Oh, this could be fun. Yeah, we're gonna take the bamboo home with us. We can build like a a wall out of bamboo. It'll be great. What? What what have we here? Hello there. Oh my gosh, there's seals. Oh. The ocean, the, the 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 puppies of the sea, if you will. We're gonna leave them be. I like them. I was gonna get all the bamboo, but we have too much bamboo already. I didn't really think about how much we were gonna end up with. Cactails? Get us. I think we've already got some sugar cane, but just in case, we're going to stop and grab some more. And then it'd be nice if we came across a desert biome, and we could get some cacti and bring that back with us as well. Oh yeah, look, there's one of those guys. There they are. Don't like them. They're scary. They just pop up behind you. Look, there's one with like a trident or something. Don't like that. There do be land over there. Whoa! Hey, wait a tick. What am I looking at here? Whoa! Dude, what is this? What is this? <laughs> is this anything? It looks like it could be something. Wow. Okay, alright. Let's just hop out here and have a look at this. Mossy stone. Oh, the biomes you'll go. Oh, indeed. How did these two get swapped? Explain that to me. Um, let's head inside, I guess. I saw what looked like an entrance, kind of like up at the front. So I guess we'll, we'll more or less mine our way kind of up and around. Yeah, here we go. Oh. Is this just nothing? I thought this was like some sort of a tower or a fortress or something. Oh, yeah. Um, well, kinda. Do we have any torches? I don't think we brought any. I brought the materials to build them. And the reason I didn't just go ahead and build them is because I didn't want to use all of my uh, coal on that. In case we needed coal for something else, we could just like make them dynamically kind of as we went. But I don't know, man. It's just liquid down there. Okay. Well, this is weird and I don't really see the point of it. Oh my gosh, is that a village? That do look like a village! Oh, we're gonna swing by here and say hi to these people. And uh, this will be also a good opportunity. I mean, I hope they're all friendly. I actually don't see any villagers on the map, which is weird. Take a look at our map here and see how far we've come. So we've, we've traveled quite a ways here. We did pass a bit of a, a bit of a swampy area back there. We're still kind of looking for desert still kind of not finding it which is fair I mean what we missed something down there I don't even want to speculate what that is uh, it is getting dark though so give me that well actually no we'll leave a light source back here so we can find our way back hello what are you a Tasmanian devil we're in Australia everybody congratulations uh no, oh, they have really strict COVID lockdowns, don't they? I got a feeling that they're not going to let me go on an adventure. <laughs> Is it too real? I'm sorry. Let's sleep. <laughs> oh, monsters are already popping into existence around us, too. Didn't quite get to sleep fast enough. Well, they got bread and emeralds and leather pants around here. It is Australia. I'm going to leave behind wheat seeds in exchange for bread. Emerald looks fun. Is it more fun, though, than... Ebony plank, yes, because I can very easily get more of that. That's one of those guys. All right, well, well, I don't know if I really want to mark this place in the map because what good is an abandoned village to me? When am I ever going to need to come back here? I guess I need to collect their. Oh, there is a villager here. There's a villager here. He's a farmer. Hello, farmer. How are you? Do you have any better trades than that? No. There's an iron golem. Why are these guys not on the map? Hello there. Leather worker. Okay. I could pay a whole lot for a leather tunic if I wanted to. 
Um, not really interested in that. You don't have a Fletcher around here by chance, do you? Hi. Can you come here? Come here. You're just a regular villager. Oh my gosh. Um, I'm tempted to steal all of their stuff. We don't really need that much bamboo. So, there we go. Yeah. Uh, that was onion. Do we need onion that badly? Sort all of that. See, I want all of this. What? <sighs> it's hard to give things up, though. Industrial hemp seed we don't need. We we have potatoes growing at home. We don't have onion or apple. Can we make apple seeds? We can make apple sprout. Apple growing on a leaf. That's fun. We might actually want to do that. We only have two apples, though. We're going to take the onions as well. Uh, all right. Well, well, we will eat... We will eat some of their bread. Actually, do we have anything that we can eat that will? Yeah, we'll eat the we'll eat the jerky first because we're likely to clear out of that first. We should have brought emeralds with us. So we can do some trading while we're here. Hi there! Wow, you're an interesting fellow. A gunsmith. There's guns in this game. Oh, my inner Texan just roared with enthusiasm. Oh, it's a whale. I was gonna say this was some weird sound effects. It's just a whale again, though. Just killing fish. What a little monster. Yeah, more bread. Love that. Cabbage seeds could be fun. As could rice. Again, though, I just, I have so many things. I don't need this stuff. Let's be honest. I don't, I, I can get, I, mossy cobble, I can get all that anywhere. Definitely take that feather. We need to make more arrows. We're not really stealing. We're doing an exchange. There's a child. Uh, where's your possessions, little one? I'm here to take them. I don't think of myself as a thief so much as I think of myself as a, uh... Oh, a man of means by no means. A nitwit. Is that your name or is that your station in life, Mr. Nitwit? Orchard leaves. Oh. Interesting. And that gives us, uh... Alright. Okay, fun. Is that from the same mod? That's from Cyclic. Okay. It's just weird. Orchard leaves. I've never heard of such a thing. Composter. Are we just pretending like these things are normal? Um, I really don't want to. I mean, these guys have been so good to me. I'm just gonna take one of their carrots. That's it. And I will. I will leave behind for them some Inferium essence in exchange. And I'll just take that home with me, and I'll plant that, and that'll be my carrot supply. So I guess what we will do is we will go ahead and uh, waste stone. Current location. I'm sorry, Dracker record, rec 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 record, Dracker rec, Dracker Cool. Uh, I've activated the waystone. Presumably, I can fast travel here if I add another waystone, which is cool. What? Was that you? What the heck was that? We're going home. Our inventory's full. We're kind of, like, depressed now about... Is that an orca? It's a killer whale, everyone. We don't want to shrek with them, actually. They're pretty nasty. Uh, We can't do what we set out to do because we can't get coral until we get silk touch. Kind of every plan that I make just sort of falls through in the end, doesn't it? Just after a while. I'm going to do this. Well, no, I need slime. Well, we'll, we'll get slime by doing this. Well, no, we need we need coral. Well, we'll go on an adventure to get coral. No, you need silk touch. Well, then we'll just sail home. Well, no, there's a whale! It all just falls apart in the end. You'll never find cacti, my friend. You'll sail around the world until the end. And you'll be right back where you started again. And that's okay, that's alright, you'll see one day. It was all a waste of time, now you're at the end of the line. It's time for you to die and be free. What is this, a boat? Some sort of like a, a tumped over boat? That was a sad song, wasn't it? I stand by it. <laughs> what, what is this? Is there anything in the hold? Where, there's a chest there. Oh, well. Hello. I'll take some more carrots, please. I don't need wheat. Um, curse of foolishness? What is that? 
Suspicious Stew, Bamboo, we'll take your rice. Uh, projectile Protection 3, I don't know, I've got pretty good armor as is. Well, and it's okay, yes, it's all right. In the end, nothing mattered anyway, so I guess I'll just say... I hope you have a good day and find a better way. Yeah. What? I'm sorry, what was that? What 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 was that? That was a horrific noise. Hello there, big guy. How are you doing? Just 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 parading yourself around out here, aren't you? Much respect to you. Please let me pass. Please. Thank you. Well. Nice to be back on solid, familiar ground. I really feel like we were making some excellent progress in the modded department. Until we were just suddenly not. And maybe that's okay. Maybe we don't have to make excellent progress in the modded department. Maybe we can just enjoy playing regular old Minecraft and just... You know, every so often something wacky happens, like a like a modded thing just happens, and then we come back home, and we've got a bunch of uh, various foods to cook. Although actually, we should do some planting first, I guess. So first things first, we're gonna plant ourselves a couple of carrots here. Lovely, and then we're gonna plant ourselves a couple of cabbage seeds to whatever end. Love that. And then we do have some onions, so I guess we'll plant those. And then besides those, we'll plant our uh, beetroots. And then I don't really know what to do with the apple sprouts. If we check our uses, it's not really giving me anything. Um, can't really plant them. What, what do you do with an apple sprout? Apple growing on a leaf. It doesn't really say. Can't plant it. Can't just plop it down. Oh. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Sorry? I beg your pardon? Where did you come from? You're just here. Can I keep you here? Please don't leave. Come back. Uh, <laughs> it's just Perry. Perry the platypus. I can also get... Oh, yeah. A jungle sapling, a brown dye. Oh, there's some cyan dye. Honestly, yeah, that saves me a lot of effort. Thank you. I'll just take one of those. A blood sack might also be useful. Can I keep you? I don't want you to leave. I want you to be with me forever. Maybe you never get new trades. Maybe I have to let you go to get it. No, come back. There's literally nowhere for you to go. You're stuck up here. You can't just leave. I'm not joking either. Like There is nowhere else for you to go. You're stuck on my mountain with me now. And I would advise that you just learn to, like, make the most of that and enjoy it, okay? So, please stop trying to wander off. And, uh, let me see here. There we go. Place one of those there. One of those there. There. I didn't mean to do that. No, come back! I was so close to having you right where I wanted you. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to, like, physically harm you. I just want to, like, imprison you in my fortress. Please don't walk on my potatoes, actually, though. There we go. All right, no chance of him leaving now. He just has to stay around here now. He has to stay here forever. And, and yes, yeah, sell me all the cyan dye that I want. Or cayenne, if you're so inclined. I know. Folks, I don't really know what I'm doing anymore with my life or with this series, but thank you for tuning in and watching. I hope you've enjoyed yourselves. Tune in next time, and I'll do something. I haven't decided what yet. Bye!